Okay, what I have here are two different pieces uh, that I used to uh, form that particular band with. This is a rounded piece of um, six inch pipe. Uh, and then I have two pieces of one inch pipe uh, welded on a plate. Um, approximate distance is enough to get my 18 or 16 gauge steel sheet metal in here and bend it. So I use this as a bender and I use this as a bender. And how I do it is this right here. I'll take a piece of band that I've made and I'll place it on here, usually with a clamp. And then I can take and I can roll this metal by pushing it down around this pipe to get a circumference that I'm looking for. If, it's, if it is a narrower bend, a narrower bend that I need, I'll take and put it in here slide it in and bend it the direction that I need and this allows me to make a much narrower bend uh, and hopefully to come out with the design and the roll and the curvature that I'm going to need. So let me show you a piece that I've already bent and show you what I mean. Okay here's the piece that I have cut out and now here's a, a piece of stock that I have bent to work with the shape. Right here you can see the circumference that I have and when I lay this on top of here and tack weld it in place it will give the illusion of depth as you can see from the side view that I'm looking for. And I did all that with a very primitive bending source. I don't have a roller. Um, I wish I did but I don't right now. And you can do this too just as simply as I did this. What you see here now is the two sides, which were cut with the plasma cutter, that gives the initial shape of the object, combined with the metal band, which was cut out and then bent on my, uh, my uh, pipe and my makeshift uh, fine-tune bender, and then placed upright and tack welded into position. You can see some of the tacks around there. Um, this next shot is of the final product, um, well it's not complete yet, but uh, to this stage, anyhow, where it's been welded, it's been ground down and sanded to a, uh, a rough degree, but this gives you the uh, impression of the object as it will appear, appear in the uh, final sculpture. So that's it for this video. I hope to see you next time. Um, again, I'm Bob with Mineworks Metalwork in West Virginia.